We're standing here with the featured artist herself. This is Camera Face. How are you doing tonight? I'm way nervous is what I am right now. Oh my goodness, because this is your first exhibit, your first live exhibit, right? Yes, my first one and for reason. Like I can't, I'm a process artist. Anything after that I just like fall apart. Like I, it's too much. It's like you're putting your soul out there a bit. It's like... Well I think judging by the crowd you're getting quite a good reaction tonight. Yeah, it's all my homies showed up. That's like to me so important that they showed up. Do you have any favorite pieces in the exhibit? To be honest, all of these are my favorite. I have a, I have thousands and thousands of photos, so like there's a lot of favorites and a lot of these are these are all real moments. So they all have a special meaning. Like this one right here. Uh -huh. To me it's right before the whole like gay marriage, like you know, so the equal fact that, equality. Yeah, but the fact that it was just that moment and she goes outside and it takes it takes fine to be equal, right? Right, right. So that was just like Oh my gosh, I love it. I have a little story and even if they were to never sell and I just left them in my house, I'd be happy. Yeah. You know? So how long have you been a photographer and what got you interested in shooting? And you do a lot of candid work, right? Yes. Well, I kind of, I was a stay-at-home mom, okay. and I was shooting my kids a lot, and my best friend at the time was a, a celebrity, beautiful, amazing woman, and she brought me on the road with her, so I learned to run and gun and shoot with her. Wow. So I got access to the most amazing places. I traveled all over the world, but my learning was like, it had to be fast, and I only had like seconds to think of things. So that prepared me for everything else in life. I'm glad I got that experience. I owe her everything. But um, after that, then I was like, okay, I'm going to branch out and try because brands were starting to hit me up. So I was like, all right, I'll try that too. So I kind of shoot anything and everything, but uh -huh. my thing is moments okay. because of growing up on the road and having to catch moments. Wow, I think you definitely captured it here. I think your photos are amazing. Thank you. What kind of equipment are you using currently? Only this. And this is a Canon? Yes, Canon 5D Mark II. And this flash, and I've shot everything on this. So it's like, I really enjoy having nothing and trying to make something out of nothing at all times. And keeping it raw. Yeah, well, like I, a lot of times when I'm walking, I just stop randomly and I'm like, okay, if I only had this space, what would I do with this space? Okay. So I'm constantly trying to stay in that world and just use whatever I have. My mentor is out here, his name is Randall Slavin. Okay. He said the most amazing things so to like, me. It doesn't matter what you're shooting on, it just matters that you're shooting. So take whatever it is, a picture is a picture. And when he said that to yeah, me, I was, it was like, like the whole world opened up. So I just started shooting and shooting and shooting. So. Wow, well, I think you have an amazing exhibit. Thank you so much for inviting us out tonight. If anybody didn't get out to make it to your first exhibit, how can we follow you or track you or see what you're up to next? Uh, most people know me as Camera Face, so CameraFace.com, but there's no E in camera. Okay. And then on Instagram, I'm my third account, so now I'm Photo Fetish, so it's F-O-T-O -O, Fetish. Yes, and those are, they're sexy. They're, they're, they're definitely some sexy work you've got going on there. Thank you so much.